Hello guys. So I'm back after after like a long week, I think a week and a half of like not uploading anything. Uh, I'm back. I'm sorry for the long wait. Uh, I was getting situated with school starting uh, as well as just not really having anything to upload. I tried uploading Elder Scrolls online beta footage but I got struck down because of the NDA. Uh, it was some, some stupid agreement where, oh, if you're not part of the press, you can't upload footage because you're just, it's just not allowed. It was some, some bullshit like that. So anyway, I am back, and this time with another beta that does not have an NDA. Uh, this is Titanfall. We're playing on the Xbox One today. Uh, I also have it installed on PC. I will be doing PC capture videos. So if you stay tuned, I will have both a uh, hour-long PC gameplay and an hour-long Xbox One gameplay for you guys to enjoy. But this is my first impressions. I, I played the game for about two hours on PC last night and for about a good 30 minutes on Xbox One. And uh, I was very impressed. I think the game's a lot of fun, especially when you get into the flow of things. Let's actually start it up. I think the, ga I think the game's a lot of fun when you get into the flow of things. And, uh, I mean, I, I really enjoyed it. I, I, I think it's pretty cool. It's sort of... The best way I can sort of describe it is if you take the fast-paced and tight controls of Call of Duty mixed in with the strategic combat of a game like Battlefield and then put some crisis in there with jumping and, uh, and the verticality of the environments and such, this is basically what you get, Titanfall. But the game has enough depth to, uh, to itself to basically make it a... Uh, its own sort of game, its own sort of experience, so that it doesn't sort of um, try to, it's not really trying to be something else, it's trying to be its own game, which I really, really, really liked. Alright, so, I'm going to be playing here, it's exciting, I did actually pretty well, Once you know, once you get the hang of things, you actually do pretty decent, so, it's pretty cool. I think, uh, I'm, I'm sort of having, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm sort of having trouble here. All right, choosing choosing a platform for this game. I originally pre-ordered this game on the Xbox One. I then switched my pre-order to the PC after hearing that the Xbox One Alpha was like not in really good shape at all. We're actually gonna be playing. I like Hardpoint a lot, so we're gonna be playing that. And uh, oops, whoa, whoa, whoa. Can I go back? Okay, here we go. Yeah. So um, I could have. I I swear to you guys. My freaking game just froze up. I'm not kidding. My, my freaking game just froze. Oh. All right, we're off to a good start. <laughs> freaking game's freezing and shit. Freaking go in here, jeez. Speed of this console. All right. Um, where was I? Yes. I, I so so I switched my pre-order to the PC version after hearing that the alpha version of this game did not look good and was not really you know it's an alpha so <laughs> I, I was I was getting kind of worried for uh, the version of this game but I, I'm playing the beta right here and I swear to you I swear that there are textures on the Xbox One that look better than the PC version on high settings. Now, to be fair, I'm not running the game with insane texture quality because the insane texture quality setting requires 3 gigabytes of VRAM, and I'm sitting here with 1.2. So uh, I don't have enough memory to... I, I can run it on insane settings, but the frame rate's going to be dipping quite frequently, and, uh, you know, it's it's I, I'd rather not do that. So it is 792p... Very odd resolution, but that is the resolution that Titanfall is running in on the Xbox One. They do use really good anti-aliasing, though, so it really does get rid of the jaggies and stuff like that um, to, to, to a better degree than most other games on here. So I do, uh, I do like the fact that they actually used you know, a really good MSA quality for the anti-aliasing. Um, that being said... Um, the game, the game does handle fine, though. It, it, it does handle, it does handle quite fine. Uh, it's 60 frames per second. There is slight screen tearing. Like I said, it is a beta, and supposedly the developers said that the final version of this game may, big, you know, word may run at 900p, making it uh, basically the equivalent to the resolution, the PS4 version of, of Battlefield 4. So uh, 
hopefully they can get it to run in 900p. I think 900p with the game looking as good as it does already would actually be uh, pretty pretty good. So, um, but but yeah, uh, the game does look pretty decent, and uh, you know it is the Source Engine, but it's heavily modified. Uh, with that being said, so I mean I don't I don't really know. It's like I can get the PC version, and hopefully they'll increase the the graphics and the textures on high settings and it'll look better or I can get the Xbox One version hopefully they'll increase the resolution and it's really I'm really torn because I have friends on both I got my best bud Goat the Great on Xbox One I also have my best bud uh, Dylan at the random videos on uh, PC so now I'm torn it's like great now I have to choose <laughs> alright so let's just jump in here and uh, to reiterate again because I'm using my capture software, I am only playing the game in 30 frames per second. So if the quality is like eh, or what, what I should say is if the gameplay is eh, um, you try playing games like this in 30 frames per second. Alright. Oh shit. Oh, get up there. Well, great start. Game freezes and then I die. Three frames per second, man. I'm ready. Oh, I totally forgot to mention this. Fuck. I totally forgot to mention this. I actually just ordered an HDMI splitter for for capturing direct footage on the PlayStation 4 so there will be no more camera by the time Thief comes out. I don't know why it's taking Sony a millennia to get this patch updated or, or put on the PlayStation 4. It's just it's ridiculous. It's like come on. You told us that you'd have a patch to fix the fixes before the console was even out. Here we are. What was it four months? Almost four months into the console's uh, life cycle, and you haven't released this patch yet. It's like WTF, man. All right. Yeah, I do like I like Hardpoint a lot. Attrition's cool, but it's just that. You have to bully these titans. Watch this. Yes! Damn it! Alright. We almost got the guy. So, max level is level 14, for those of you who are wondering. And, uh, our levels do not actually transfer into the full game. And rightfully so, you know, you, you don't want to have people start off. And this game's not fun in 30 frames. <laughs> yeah, this game's not fun in 30 frames. I have a Titan. I have a Titan. I didn't spawn yet. One sec. Sometimes uh, I like playing on the ground a little bit. Damn it! All right, let's spawn in our Titan. Titan. Get this guy! I'm outnumbered. I gotta recharge my shield. There we go. This guy. 
Jeez. <laughs> There's so much chaos. Alright. WTF, man. Jeez, we're losing all the points, really? Come on. Let's get this tight right here. Okay, so, because of this is, I guess because this is a first impression, so I'm supposed to be giving guys my thoughts. Um, here's what I think. I think the game plays nice. I do like the way it plays. Um, I think, like I said, I think it's creating an identity for itself, which is, you know, very helpful when you're trying to launch a new multiplayer-only IP like this. You want to make sure it can create an identity for itself, and I think it definitely can. Um, it does borrow the best elements from, you know, both Call of Duty, Battlefield, and, uh, you know, even Crisis, for example. Um, but, uh, yeah, I mean, I, I, I like it. I do. I, I, I like it. Is this the best freaking multiplayer experience I've ever played in my entire life? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> In fact, I, I, I'm trying to remember if there is, like, a definitive multiplayer that I actually loved. Jeez, I was going to jump on that guy. He knew. Yeah, he knew. He freaking knew. Okay, let's go to A. Yes, we know. Jeez, we're, we're losing pretty badly right now. <laughs> we're not. We're not going to win this. And I do like the wall running. It actually. It's pretty cool. Damn it. Yeah, we're done. We're done. I'm gonna jump on this Titan right here. Alright, never mind. Damn it! <laughs> Alright, well, I'm done. Probably play, uh,. I wonder how long the recording is going on. Okay, yeah, I'll probably play for like another match. Oh yeah, I, I am going to be buying DX Tori actually this week, so... That's what I'm actually going to be using to capture this game on the PC, DX Tori. Dude, that plane's going to get destroyed. Oh! Just as it was about to leave! <laughs> Just as it was about to leave. Alright, so I did horrible. Because I never played the game of 30 frames per second before, but now I know. Now I know. It's okay. It's alright. Yeah. Oh, by the way, I don't think I told you guys. Um, freaking people on my shut the fuck up. I don't think I told you guys. Um, I did pre-order Castlevania: Lords of Shadow 2 after playing the excellent, excellent demo that they had for the game. It was a, that was an amazing demo, man? Really amazing demo. So, I did pre-order Castlevania: Lords of Shadow 2. And uh, cannot wait for it. it. comes out the same day as Thief. However, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be picking up Thief. Uh, and I pre-ordered pre Lords of Shadow 2 on PC, by the way. It's, it's, it's digital only on PC, unfortunately. But, I mean, I was just like, fuck it. And I actually got it for 40 bucks. So I was like, you know, I, I, got, I got a deal. Actually, you know what? You guys paid for it. So you two paid for it. So it was kind of free. <laughs> but I was like, I got a deal. Who cares? You know, I'll just suffer the digital distribution this time. 
Um, but yeah, I'm excited for the game. I really am. I played the demo. It was excellent. The game ran max settings and was gorgeous. The game was just gorgeous. So it's going to be an epic, epic game. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be getting Thief on release date, but I am also going to... Uh, um, I'm going to be playing Thief first, and then I'm going to be playing Castlevania Lords of Shadow 2 after. All right. So when I beat Thief... Um, I will be playing Lords of Shadow 2. Now, I am currently still playing through the first Lords of Shadow. I never beat it, but I've owned the game for years. However, the game glitched on me, unfortunately, and I was unable to continue. When I switched my PlayStation 3 hard drive and I upgraded to 500 gigabytes a couple weeks ago, um, I was able, I guess something, somehow it just fixed that glitch and I was able to progress through the game. And I think I have like three or two more chapters left until I complete the final game or, or, or the end of the game. And uh, it's going to be... Uh, gonna be pretty cool so I mean I really I'm really enjoying Lords of Shadow I'm kinda hitting myself because I wasn't able to play it before because of a stupid bullshit glitch but I'm able to play it now and I want to be able to beat the game before Lords of Shadow 2 comes out and it's gonna be epic alright 30 frames per second let's do this Okay, we're all good here. Hard points Bravo and Charlie are still open. Get over there and patch my team into the system. Boom! I'll give you that. Denied. Oh my god, I was gonna freaking. Now she had an assault rifle. This person had me, they had an assault rifle. Alright. What the hell? Jeez. They're all coming to A. God! Alright, fine, let's, let's hurry up and get B. So at least we have a point if we lose A. Which we're losing A right now, unfortunately. All right, come on. Yeah. Um. Here's the thing about the bots. It's like I, I never got the, I never got the feeling that six on six was small in this game. I think I think it actually works out very really, really well. The problem with bots is that they're so stupid. They're like so dumb. They will literally sit there, stare at you for five seconds before they actually fire their weapon. And when they do fire their weapon, as you can see, they don't even hit you. It's like they're 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 incredibly look at this. Look at that. <laughs> it's like they're so stupid. I understand, you know that they have to they have to you know lower the difficulty because they don't want people getting killed by bots all of a sudden, but it's like it's it's stupid. It's like they're incredibly dumb. Alright, we're getting we're getting A and now we're hitting C, but we're losing B. Alright. Yeah, I love this game mode, actually. It's a lot of fun. Oh my god. So that was obviously a player. Damn it, we're losing C now. Alright, let's get B, let's get B. Here we go. Oh, whoa, enemies behind here. Oh. We got it covered. Oh shit. Let's get this guy. No! No! Titan's ready. Alright, we have to get C. We have to get C, hold on. Ugh, I was gonna jump on him! Alright, no! Damn it! I wanted to spawn on my Titan. Here we go.
mine. Alright, I'm going for C. This guy, this guy's about to have it. Oh! Dude, this guy's dead. God, I can't see anything. Take and be. There's my Titans following me. What he's supposed to. Damn. Can't reach that. No! Salty as a sea dog, really? Look, my Titan. Did he? Is my Titan dead? Oh, he's right here. Okay, let's go take A from them. I'm not dead. Now your Titan's dead. Boom! Oh, he's mad. Ah, oh, he got his revenge. Okay. <laughs> he was pissed. Right, I'm going for A. Damn it! Yeah, he got me. No, we're losing B. We can't. Nope, that one's ours. Not for sale. This one's ours. Try and fall over there. Okay, I'm going for uh, going for A. Damn it! I'm not making this one. <laughs> Oh, he didn't see me. Wow, what a sap. You prick. I got him, too. <laughs> oh, I died. I died uh, after the epilogue thing. Man. Alright. 
Oh! Gret's neck. Dude, look at that earthquake and look at the cities falling in the background. That's pretty cool. And we and they got out. That's cool. Oh. They left some people. Alright. So uh those were my first impressions on Titanfall. It's a really fun game. I enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. Uh the beta ends tomorrow, so I'm gonna get to recording uh more videos for Titanfall. As well as uh, you know, for for like the PC platform and such. And uh, I guess I'll see you guys later. All right. Have a great day. Talk to you later. Goodbye.